We are not saying that it is only one person that will vie for the position. One person doesn't vie. We are going to get some candidates that are going to vie. And out of them, the person we have seen right now is Chief Obonna. I don't know about tomorrow, who else that will come. But for today, Chief Obonna has all it takes to clean the image of Ohanes Ndibo, Lagos State. Everything you think about, he has it. He is very, very overqualified in short. And I know that when he handles Ohanes Ndibo, Lagos State affairs, 2017 through, 2000, uh, through 2021, that Ohanes Ndibo, Lagos State, will be found. I don't want to start describing him. I know him too well. And again, he's from the, uh, from the four states, Enugu, Ohaneze worldwide, said that have the opportunity to run or to buy. Those states are Ebony State, Enugu State, Delta State and Rivers. These are the states that has not tested the leadership before. So they are now going to vie for it. And he is coming from a boy. Not only that, like I said, he is overqualified. He's a man of peace. And that one is basic. He's a, a very humble person. He is a tolerant. He is loving and caring. He is not the type of person that will come and they start quarreling with anybody. We know him. And because we know him, that's why we are vouching that he is going to give us the type of leadership we want. In fact, it is God that convinced him to come. Because it is not everybody that likes to vie for such position like Ohane Zendibo. That doesn't give money. It's not a leadership that makes you get rich, make wealth. It is a leadership that gives you fame. No money. Obenna has all it takes. And by God's grace, he will be there because we are supporting him. He is very, very qualified, overqualified.